In this series, I will introduce some simple questions. It aims to let all of you feel the interesting side of mathematics. There won't be any fancy calculation, notations, or ideas. Please hit the like button and subscribe my channel. Your support is my motivation to share more interesting things. Enjoy the video. Suppose this equation has exactly one real root. Find k and solve for x. Remember what your grade 8 teacher tells you. This is a quadratic equation. Notice that you see the word real root. So you try to compute the discriminant. b squared minus 4ac equals to 0. So plug in the variables and you will get k equals to 2. Rewrite the equation. You will find x equals to 7. This is how you do quadratic equations. Wait, does anyone know what is a quadratic equation? Okay, somehow you will tell me ax squared plus bx plus c equals to 0. Yes, it is a quadratic equation, but provided that a does not equal to 0, or else it becomes a linear equation bx plus c. Now look back the question. It didn't tell you it must be quadratic. See what we have done. We have supposed the equation to be quadratic because we have computed the delta. So actually, we are doing this. Suppose k does not equal to 0. So what if k equals to 0? We have a linear equation that also yields exactly one real root. So both 2 and 0 can be the answer of this question. Math is a logic. If you just memorize formula without digesting it, mathematics would be very painful. So here are some suggestions for you to learn math. First, do not learn math by rote. Second, understand the given condition of theorems and formulas you encounter. Lastly, subscribe my channel, turn on the notification, and watch my videos introducing math. Finally, I would like to give all of you a challenge. Given a quadratic equation, if delta equals to zero, we must have one real root. If delta greater than zero, we have two real roots, and no real roots for delta less than zero. I believe you have reciting this theorem for many years. Can you prove it? Comment below if you know the answer, and share this video to challenge your friends.